Hey guys, welcome back. I'm ETC Gunner, and today I just wanna do a quick review of the Sitson Echo Dry Watch. And uh, what's the model number? Well, let me just quickly read it out for you. Uh, it says 850048 um, Sitson 10 bar water resistant. The movement is GN4WS, and there's a uh, H500SO5. 10102 I don't know I wish they could just put some normal name on uh, their watch uh, but yeah this is a uh, basically a plain Jane uh, Sitzen uh, echo dry watch for um, for the people for the masses for the malls uh, and uh, I gotta say uh, this watch uh, it kind of looks neat but I really, I really, um, I really want to like it, but I don't. I don't, I don't like it. I cannot find any faults to it. Uh, it doesn't have any flaws, uh, but I really uh, haven't bonded with it. So, uh, it's there is no connection. Uh, I, I, I tried, uh, but. Uh, I don't know, it's just a plain Jane watch for me and it's nothing, um, it's it's not cool, it doesn't have that sec second kind of cool factor. Um, you see, uh, it's not the coin I made but uh, the watch and everything else has to have that second kind of cool. So this is a, just a plain Jane Sitson watch, you can find it in the malls. I picked this up for review uh, and it was a bargain uh, otherwise I wouldn't I wouldn't get it and it's kind of it's kind of reminiscent of this bezel uh, it's reminiscent of um, kind of when you put it on your wrist looks like a bright link uh, this is a Sitzen Echo Drive it's basically solar powered watch uh, Sitzen calls it Echo Drive some other companies call it solar powered but the same has a uh, solar battery panel underneath the dial or wherever and the sunlight charges the battery it can last a quite a quite some time uh, this is a chronograph uh, and you can see it works like this just a plain old chronograph and uh, this here dial has a time of the day indicator so right now you can see it's it's in the morning it's in the a.m. and yeah the hands are glowing blue in the dark and that's one of the cool things uh, I like about it but overall this is a great watch for someone uh, to gift someone who's not into watches who is not a watch collector who is not something but uh, I don't know uh, it's I really haven't bonded with this watch, uh, so it doesn't really speak to me. Uh, it's not an ugly watch. It's quite a, quite attractive watch on a wrist. Uh, you can tell, but uh, it, it looks kind of, it looks rich uh, because of this uh, checkered pattern uh, bezel uh, here. But I think this bezel is a bit too much. It kind of works well with the with the band and the band is a uh, this is a uh, don't know what I don't I think it's called ballistic nylon uh, it's waterproof it, this is basically nylon and down there you have a leather lining uh, but uh, it doesn't feel um, it kind of feels cheap as it does here empty spaces and basically feels like a ten dollar uh, band which probably it is uh, another, uh, there is one cool thing on this watch, but it kind of goes unnoticed. Uh, it goes under the radar, and this and that's these are those these cool lugs you can see here, and you cannot really notice these cool lugs because of the, this checkered bezel. Uh, I would prefer the black bezel or something like that. That I think with the black bezel, this watch would be a bomb. But uh, these uh, lugs are just awesome, like on uh, one those vintage watches. But they go under the radar just because of the, uh, this bezel. And uh, when you discover these lugs, uh, I immediately find this watch 
to be a lot more cooler uh, than it was before but yeah uh, this is it I cannot say I, I like it I love it but this is a, just a decent watch from Sitzen uh, uh, don't ask me how much it is I've got it uh, I got it used it was a bargain so uh, maybe you can I will try to find it on Amazon for you and put a link in the description box if not there's something similar or something maybe cooler but yeah it's okay it's, it's an echo drive watch um, also uh, there's a nice touch on the pushers here uh, I'll show you here you can see on the pushers there's a little blue lines it's a really cool stuff uh, and yeah uh, overall uh, it's a really uh, interesting watch but uh, it's not something for my collection or something for um, I don't know what to say I really haven't bonded with this watch uh, and it's not the first time it happened but uh, it does happen uh, sometimes and uh, it's a really sad thing uh, so I wanna hear guys I wanna hear from you guys has this ever happened to you you bought a watch and uh, it just there was no chemistry it's a, it's, a, it's a nice watch don't get me wrong you can see it's an attractive watch on the wrist but uh, maybe I will learn to love it uh, with time so I'm definitely I was definitely wearing it for a couple of days and uh, I'll try to wear it a bit more and uh, it kind of looks cool um, but I don't know there's there's something something that's not it kind of looks doesn't say I'm a watch collector when I wear this I think that's the biggest thing with <laughs> this watch for me uh, and uh, yeah uh, thank you for watching I'm EDC Gunner uh, Sitsen uh, makes a great watches it's a good quality uh, this is a mineral crystal stainless steel case sits in echo dry movements they pioneered and uh, created the movement sits and makes some great movements for micro brands uh, but sometimes they uh, cut the corners on some of these their budget watches but overall uh, this watch is love and hate relationship with me uh, and uh, I don't know what to say uh, if you do like it uh, it's a good purchase it's and makes a great watches they have a great, they're a great brand sits and Seiko oriented general uh, you can never go wrong with them but make sure you like the watch I like the watch this is a bull bull da, dark bull uh, band and the dial is also dark bull and uh, I'm still getting used to it uh, but uh, yeah I just wanted to put out here this quick review maybe I will trade it for something else and this will go unreviewed so uh, I'm ADC Gunner uh, thank you for watching I'm trying to bring as many watches as possible on this channel so please subscribe and see you on the next one